I think we're in for a good one, guys, as we now have a bit of an update to the whole Leslie Benzies vs. Rockstar thing. Just a bit of a TLDR if you missed my video from yesterday, although if you want all the nitty gritty, go and watch that. Basically, the ex-Rockstar North President Leslie Benzies is suing Take-Two for $150 million over unpaid royalties and various other fairly serious accusations. And now, Rockstar has since filed a countersuit and has even issued a statement, and I think this is going to be a very interesting court case. Here's what they had to say. Quote, Leslie Benzies was a valued employee of our company for many years. Sadly, the events that culminated in his resignation ultimately stem from his significant performance and conduct issues. Despite our repeated efforts to address and resolve these issues amicably both before and after his departure, Leslie has chosen to take this route and attempt to set aside contract terms in which he previously agreed on on multiple occasions. His claims are entirely without merit and in many instances downright bizarre, and we are very confident this matter will be resolved in our favour. A core ethos since Rockstar's inception has been the concept of the team. It is deeply disappointing and simply wrong for Leslie to attempt to take personal credit for what has always been the tremendous efforts of the entire Rockstar team, who remain hard at work delivering the most immersive, engaging entertainment experiences we can for our fans. And they are actually seeking damage compensation against Benzies. So you have Benzies suing Rockstar for 150 million over his unpaid royalties and other accusations. And then you've got Rockstar counter suing for damage compensation and basically saying that he's making it all up. I predicted that this was going to be messy when I did this video yesterday, and oh lord, was I right. Oh dear. It's going to be very interesting to see what comes to light out of this. Now, obviously, with any lawsuit where obviously you aren't directly involved, it's really hard to know who's in the right and who's in the wrong, who's lying and who's not. I'm just going to sit back and watch because it could be either one of them. Now, Leslie Benz's accusations seem a bit too detailed and too sort of... Well, just detailed. There's a lot of things happening that would be a hard story to make up and make it seem convincing. So, I... I was kind of thinking that it was probably true yesterday, but of course he could be making it up, it's definitely possible. We should all obviously wait and see the evidence, but I'm not exactly shocked that Rockstar have come up this swinging, and it's going to be interesting to see if their money speaks louder or not. Personally, I actually hope the accusations aren't true, because it paints Sam and Dan Hauser in some pretty not very nice lights if the accusations are true. So I'd actually prefer if they weren't. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens. Of course, I will update you as soon as more information becomes available. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.